Hello everyone, uh, this is Sango Nanami. Uh, I apologize for the uh, noise in the background, that is my computer's fan, and I am currently missing my good mic. I get a lot of requests uh, on how to start off on MMD, and how I make my videos, and what programs I use. So I figured I would just make one big tutorial. So this is the website that you want to start with. Actually, before you even do that, you need to uh, change your system locale to Japanese. So first we're going to go over to Control Panel, and then uh, there's a bunch of junk here, so we're just going to type it in. Just type in region. Region and language should come up. And go to the Administrative tab and change system locale to uh, Japanese. Now what that does it is, is it uh, makes it easier for your computer to read the program. Alright, so learnmmd.com is just my go-to recommendation because they'll give you all the runtime packages and ev pretty much everything you'll need. So for example, if you're on a 32-bit system you need these runtime packages and if you're on a 64-bit system, you'll need these. So we're going to download MMD 9.31, 64-bit, since uh, I'm on a 64-bit system. So, <laughs> um, so we've downloaded MMD, we've downloaded all the resource packages. Um, here, I'll just download one of these and show you how to install them. Oh my god, leave me alone. <laughs> so, obviously uncheck this because nobody uses Bing. Bing is stupid. Nobody uses Internet Explorer. So, they'll all download as either EXE files or um, RAR files, which you open with the program WinRAR which you get right here at the sketchiest looking website on the planet. <laughs> it looks like it's riddled with viruses, I promise it's not. To my knowledge. Don't quote me. <laughs> I've used it for years, I've used it um, for all my MMD needs. It's the internet, who cares. <sighs> okay. Jeez Louise, you know what, I think I have a runtime package in my downloads folder already. Are you kidding me? Half this tutorial is just going to be waiting for stuff to load or download. Two hours later. Alright, so runtime packages will either come in as an exe file like that, or it'll come in as a raw file, or a zip file. Yeah, no one cares. So the way they have this set up is that it comes with a copy of Miku Miku Dance. Uh, I can't get this to work on my computer, which really sucks, <laughs> but happens stuff happens. With all these, you just need to double click them. I'm just gonna cancel that, but it should give you a prompt to install it, and you guys know. So with MMD, though, it doesn't need an install file. So you can literally just click and drag MMD from there. So, open it up. And this should be what you get. Do, 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 do. Um, let's see. Oh, that's my MMD that's a giant thing. So, let's go to the basic things. You should have uh, accessory, background model, motion, pose, VSQ, and wave folders. So, under model, they'll give you a bunch of samples. Give you um, a, just a bunch of vocaloids, basically. Really, really, really old models of vocaloids. Just to uh, show off what, what kind of bones we have, and I'll go into this 
in my next tutorial, which will be making a model. Um, so these are the bones we have. We have IK bones do, 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 that do that. Which it's, it's very fun to play with IK bones when you have a model like Miku. She's got this her. Uh, IK bones usually are used for legs though, to make it easier to walk. We have normal bones, which you can rotate whatever way you want. I want to die. We have an eye bone, which is cool. It applies to both eyes, so you can move very ugly Miku's eyes whichever way you want. Miku and the last kind of bones are bones that um, actually control the physics of the model and her outfit. So we're not going to be a perv and look under her skirt, but I'm just showing you that her skirt moves. Oops, I think there was a panty shot in there. Ooh, that was definitely a panty shot. That's not appropriate. So if we turn on physics, you just go to physical operations anytime. Then she'll begin to move and a lot of bones will disappear. Now this one does not have a mother bone, so it's going to be a little harder to move her around. But you can see she moves just fine. And uh, Miku, God. Usually, models don't flash their underwear like that. Maybe it's the angle. Here we go. Do that. YouTube is very strict about these things nowadays. Alright, and so that's uh, really all you need to know about starting off on MMD. I hope to see you all in the next video. Um, yeah. Bye!